Guess what night of the week it is? Well, not night of the week. It's been like several weeks, but oh yes, it's ladies' night and the feelings right. Oh yes, it's ladies' night. Oh what a night! Yes, it is, folks. It is ladies' night, and I am on the way now to meet my friend Heather, and we are going to Turning Stone Casino. That's whenever I say we're going to the casino, that's the casino I'm talking about. Going to Turning Stone to one of our favorite places. It's called The Gig. The casino has bars inside. Uh, this is the rock and roll bar. And one of our favorite bands is playing. And it's gonna be a ladies' night. And maybe, if you're lucky, I'll record some dance moves. But we'll see. Because I get distracted while I'm doing those dance moves. So, I don't know. But anyways, I'm wicked excited. JR Kev, I just saw um, your response to me that you are coming to, possibly coming to New York-ish in the spring. And do not get my hopes up because hell yeah, I wanna do something. So hopefully you'll come somewhere in my vicinity or a drivable vicinity. And we can do, what's it called? A collab. We can do a live stream too. I'm already, I'm already making plans and you're not even here yet. And you might not even come and you'd be like, bitch, calm, calm the F down, all right? Calm down. All right, that's it for now. Ladies and I, number two. Two? Watch out, motherfuckers. Number one was the first time we took our pictures together. Oh. Watch out. We're after your men. <laughs> <laughs> New York State Fair, volume two. Good morning slash afternoon, y'all. It is friggin' gorgeous out. It is cool enough to wear a sweatshirt, which is the weather I prefer. It feels like fall today. And it's getting closer. The only thing is like this. I don't think, I think I've already told this. You know I love fall. I hate when my son goes back to school. I wish we could flip this around. I wish school got out in August and didn't start back up until January. All right, or I would settle for September. Hold on. Do you know what I'm saying? So that they could have the fall off. And all the good holidays, they were automatically home instead of only getting like two weeks. And no, no time for Halloween. Even though my kid is way too old and way out of and being interested in Halloween, it doesn't matter. Little kids would love it. Anywho, today we get to go do my most pleasurable activity, and that's back to school shopping. <laughs> we all know how much I love this and spending that money. Because we all know what a pain in the butt my son is to shop with. No, I don't like this. No, I don't like that. No, I don't like this. No, I don't like that. No, no, no. What's the hardest thing, most obscure thing? Oh, and rarely have anybody sizes in? Yeah, I want that. So I'm dreading it. So I'm walking my dog. Dude, can we talk about the fact that I cannot believe the vlog is almost over? I'm actually bumming out. I'm hoping, I'm hoping Fluffy and everybody else in this collab is, is up for maybe doing vlogtober hopefully you'll have a month off so we can start up again if not i'm gonna make you guys i'm gonna come to your houses and force the camera in your faces i'm gonna force you to do vlogtober with me my eyes are tearing damn it i just did my makeup how about spending the time to do your makeup right you get it all done well you know like half-ass makeup because i'm only going shopping it's like i'm going out for a ladies night but, so you spend the time to do that, and then I'm gonna pull up close. Time to put the mascara on, and then you F off the mascara and get some under here. So if you look, there's some here, and not under there. And you get some on here that dries so quick because I use waterproof, and I can't get it off. So all that time you spent is wasted with the two seconds of putting mascara on. Not, not cute, and not happy about it. What are you doing, Pope? So, 
I've been sneezing like a mofo today. Not happy about that. My eyes haven't really been doing the tearing thing in several weeks, and I'm not happy that it's starting up again. So obviously something's in the air. It's irritating me. My hair looks like somebody took a shit in it, but what are you gonna do? I'm trying to think if I had anything surprisingly and wonderfully interesting, and I don't think I do. I don't think I do at all. Guys, I am, I know I've said it before, but I am so in to the law of attraction right now. Why are we, why are we eating grass? Can you, can you explain yourself, please? Hey, oh, now we got a rock. Now we got a rock, huh? Can you say hi? Can you say hi? Can you say hi? No? Yeah, at least you got to see the, the big old rock in her mouth. I don't understand that desire. How could it be fun? It doesn't taste good. There we go. the entire time we go shopping I just I just can't wait so you know what that's gonna do he's gonna he's gonna mess up and he's gonna give me some attitude and then what what do you think's gonna happen mom's gonna flip out start screaming in the middle of a store don't you give me your attitude we're shopping for you today and this needs to get done yeah it's gonna be one of them days I'm already dreading it so I apologize to Boscov's, TJ Maxx, and Dick's Sporting Goods because I'm sure in one of your stores, one of the three, there's going to be a public meltdown by a mother. See you then. This is the sweat of carrying a million shopping bags and putting up with the brat sitting next to me. She ain't going to let me talk. Okay, groceries are put away, school clothes are not put away. But we are home, it's 11 o'clock. We got home about 10-ish. We've been unloading and unpacking and putting away since then. And the dog's been walked and my 10,000 steps are in. And by the way, my 10,000 steps were put in with flip-flops today. I'm giving my feet a break from the sneakers. Anyway, believe it or not, all the school shopping is done. We got it all done in a day and spent every last penny of the school clothes money too, though. 
TJ Maxx, man, I love you. I love you, TJ Maxx. I can't even tell you how many things we got from TJ Maxx and only spent $240. But when you think this is the school... Sh no! When this is school shopping, like... We he needed a lot of stuff, and he got a lot of stuff. They had a lot of... I think we left there with, like, four, like, name brand sweatshirts. Like, Nike, Under Armour, stuff like that. Four or five of those. Like, six or seven mix of short sleeve and long sleeve tees. Two pairs of pants. Four pairs of shorts. Socks. We, we got a lot. We got a lot. And then we went to the mall. We went to Boscov's. We went to... I was going to record during the day, but... We were just on a damn mission. You know what I'm saying? We were on a mission. We got it done, including school supplies. And I'm not ashamed to tell you that he is reusing some of his, you know, the big three ring binders. He's reusing four of them from last year because he never used them. That's not his fault. The teachers request them and then they don't make the kids use them. So I am not buying another round of these stupid binders for them to not use them. And to be honest, this is the third year in a row that we've used these binders. Just goes to show. And when I say they haven't been used, like the teachers ask for binders and dividers, right? I left the dividers in their packaging, but stuffed them in the binders. Never touched. Still in packaging. The same filler paper that I stuffed. Yes, yes, you're right. You heard me right. I, I prepare his school supplies before he goes to school. I've always done it, and I've just... I've never stopped. So I only got one kid, man. Get off me. Okay. I like doing that stuff. I like being a mom. Those are my fun things. So the same filler paper, the same, um, cause not only did they ask for three ring binders, they asked for folders too. Same folders, still, still like the same setup for four of the main classes are still put together. Like I left them never used, not one of them. So the same, same, classes but you know obviously a, a grade above you know ask for the same exact thing so he's we're just sending him back i am not buying brand new stuff when the brand new stuff about last year got never got used you know what i'm saying so we saved there but we still had to get like the basics more filler paper pens all that kind of stuff graph paper calculator and groceries okay so we we went all over we spent a good six, seven hours out shopping. But we're home now, I'm tired, and I'm about to sit my butt down, and let me tell you, my knees are gonna be giving me the middle finger tomorrow for doing 10,000 steps and flip-flops, just so you'll know. So, talk to you guys tomorrow. Just quickly wanted to say I cannot believe it's over. I cannot believe Vlogus is over, and I am still catching up on videos, so. I'm not going to stop watching them just because it's all done. Today's August 31st. I cannot believe tomorrow is September 1st. It's amazing. Anyway, I've had a fabulous time with you all. I'm still catching up on videos. I want to do Vlogtober. I'm hoping other people will. And um, it was nice meeting a whole bunch of you uh, new people. Well, not new to YouTube, new to me. So, yeah. Happy Vlog is done, bitches. It's kind of sad and empty, doesn't it?